Check your calendars. Check your clocks. Is it 5 p.m. Eastern on a Wednesday? I believe it is, but you never know. Just ask Menchie. Welcome to the mods. Welcome to the Menchie gang. Welcome on in, everyone. Actually, I believe I had an update. Speaking of Menchie gang thing, let me grab that. How's everyone doing? It's not Saturday fast enough? Yes, Melon. Look at that luxury tail. She's got a raccoon tail on today. It's 10 p.m. in England. Is England a country? I don't know. I'm not sure if England is a country or a city. About to get off work. My first live stream catching you live. We... This is not a joke. This is not a prank. We are live. <laughs> Unless you're watching on VOD. Then we are... Then we are dead. Me and my cat are watching. Amazing. Her tail does look thick. Why? I don't know. She's in her like fluffy mode, you know? Like fluffy little rat. <laughs> She's in her rat, rat aesthetic. Grab your tea. I'm having peppermint with um, chocolate oat milk. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, minor updates. If you are in the Menchie Gang and you missed the last Menchie Gang, there is a post on the membership tab, so you should definitely go check that out. It's about... Um, Menchie Gang Holo Taco gifting. So in case you missed that, go check that out. And for more generic Menchie Gang updates, I did already do the donation for this month because I wanted to take advantage of Giving Tuesday, which a lot of like um, charitable organizations will offer some kind of promo, you know? It's like Black Friday promos, but for charities. <laughs> so on Giving Tuesday, they'll like, match your donation or something, you know, the, to incentivize people to donate. So I took advantage of their version of Black Friday and did the Menchie Gang monthly donation a little bit early just so I could hit that on a Giving Tuesday, <laughs> you know? You gotta strategize, you gotta optimize, just like your Black Friday shopping, it's the same, same kind of thing. <laughs> so I donated the other day to the Canadian C Cancer Society so we donated $3,000 to their areas of greatest need, um, but they did match it. It just doesn't say on this receipt for some reason, but they were matching donations up to like $60,000 or something. So that's good. So I'll, I'll take a match donation wherever I can seize that opportunity. So basically $6,000 was donated. <laughs> Woo! Did Ben hear Taylor Swift's new song? I mean, I don't know, ask Ben. So thank you, of course, to everyone who's in the Menchie Gang and huge shout out to everyone who's been gifting Menchie Gang memberships and also those who choose to renew their membership subscription. Ben was playing Fall Guys a few minutes ago. Bam. Anyways, big thank you to the Menchie Gang. Mm -mm -mm. We've got Menchie here for her gang, so that's always wonderful. Her new song, I Knew You Were a Donkey, when you walked in. What's your Spotify wrapped playlist like? So I don't use Spotify. I use YouTube to listen to music or pod or watch podcasts. And if YouTube did a wrapped, which they should, does YouTube do wrapped? I don't even remember. Didn't they try and do one and then it like didn't quite hit? Am I making this up? Or do they only do it for like your channel? I literally can't remember. Does anyone else's memory just like, <laughs> do you just question like, did I make that up or did that happen? You know what I mean? Like, I'm at that phase in my life where I'm like, I actually can't be sure <laughs> what happened. 
Only YouTube Rewind. Yeah, that hasn't been a thing for a few years, right? I said that the other day. I think I was joking to like Sophia in text. I was like, yeah, or like a uh, YouTube Rewind, like if they do that this year. And then Ben was like, I don't think they've done that in many years, Christine. And I was like, oh, they haven't? <laughs> I, I forgot. <laughs> like, I don't remember. I do not recall. What? What year is this? Where are we? Since COVID? Yeah, since COVID. That makes sense. But that, that was like three years ago. <laughs> YouTube mu Music has one? Okay. I know they started doing, um, as a creator in my YouTube studio, they started doing these like monthly wraps. And it like tells you what shorts had the most views basically. And mine always says the Taylor Swift short. <laughs> That's all I ever see in my creator rap is like, your Taylor Swift nails has really been killing it. And I'm just like, thank you. <laughs> Nothing else, just that one. <laughs> it's still 2017, yeah. I Sometimes I think so. I don't know what happened since, you know? What would my YouTube wrapped be? I probably wouldn't want to share it with anyone. Wait, didn't we do this? I swear to God, this happened last year and then I showed it to you and it was half trials. And I remember telling you that it was too boring and no one would care about it. Am I making this up? There must be video evidence of this. I distinctly remember this happening. <laughs> someone help me out, what happened? Oh my God. See, it did happen, thank you. I used a third party app. Oh, thank you, yes, okay, yes. So now I remember, I think I had to download my data from Google. There's like a section where you can download your data and then you had to upload it to a third party app. I think it was Ludwig, you're right, that like said you can use this. And so I gave, just gave them my data. It was just like my watch history, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> and it told you like, here's the biggest creators you watch, here's how much time. Yes, you are correct. That is what I did because YouTube didn't make a wrapped. I wonder if they're gonna make one this year. I feel like you did a podcast with your YouTube watch list ones. Yes, we did. But that wasn't like an official, you know, YouTube amalgamated, here's your top 12, here's your, you know, we're gonna expose AU. I wish they did, they should, like, come on, you know? How many years have they gone without one and then everyone's talking about Spotify wrapped? And I'm just here like, well, I don't use Spotify, so I don't know what to tell my people. Who am I gonna brag about? <laughs> what is the third party app? I can't remember. Does anyone remember? You had to download your, like you had to fetch your data from Google and upload your YouTube like watch history but I don't, I don't remember what it was. I, I would tell you if I remembered, I literally just can't. And I find I've been listening to less music and just more talking. <laughs> so it would be like extremely boring. <laughs> it would just be like, you watched uh, seven whole trials this year, <laughs> an average of six weeks per trial <laughs> or whatever. I heard third party apps are not safe privacy wives. Yeah? Who told you that? <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> I guess like, I don't know. I don't really care about my watch history. To me, it's not sensitive because, okay. So, so you know I watch trials. What are you gonna advertise to me now? <laughs> you know? Yeah, is anything on the internet safe? No one is safe. H3 talked about your nail file on the podcast. I heard that and I heard that Ethan did more than talk about my nail file. I actually heard that he put it in his mouth. Dentists hate him. Nail content creators hate him. Nail brands hate him. <laughs> Do not put a glass nail file in your mouth. This sounds like it has to come from Troom Troom, you know? It's not a problem anymore. Do you have a pointy tooth? 
Just file it with a hollow taco glass nail file and it's not a problem anymore. <laughs> I don't know if I have the clip handy. Someone put it in the Discord. I wonder if I... Oh, it's not gonna let me open it. Anyways, um, yeah, a glass nail file, why? Because he, I don't know, because he had a tooth or something that was like sticking out. <laughs> no! I don't know how to expand it, it's not working. Oh wait, here. Shout out to Simply Nail Logical. Hollow taco nail file it is the best nail file ever. This is really cool. Shark no, not the not the discontinued glass nail file color too. Never mind, just any nail file. But that's the red yellow discontinued color. <laughs> no. Okay. Anyone who all the nailies in the chat are like what? I think like he's never, this is my guess. Um, he's probably never done his own nails. I'm just guessing. I mean, I could be wrong, but this would lend, this would explain a lack of knowledge on such tools and how they are intended to be used. <laughs> now, also number two is maybe in the absence of a dentist being right there to tell him no, he just took his layperson knowledge and was like, this tool I've never used for nails before and no dentist in proximity. Oh, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna put those two things together and stick a nail file in my mouth. Do not do it. Okay, just in case you did not know, do not use a glass nail file to file your teeth down. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Viewer discretion is advised, <laughs> said the bot. This is our game recap we'll get to next. Will I find my soul? We will see. For the Menchie Gang survey, will I be kicked out for more than one entry? <laughs> uh, no, you won't be kicked out. You'll be kicked in. Sad you even have to tell us just a precaution. You you never know who's watching. You never know. <laughs> Anyways, grab your tea. Grab your tea. Grab your coffee if it's the morning. Grab your water. Mm. You became royalty today, Michi Matcha. Congratulations. That's really great news because you're gonna get a different email tomorrow. So Actually, you would have gotten it if you're a swatcher, but still, congratulations. Where can I submit an application to be your cat? Uh, applications are not open. My cat is perfect. Both my cats, actually. All right, so today we're playing episode two of Beyond Two Souls. Do I have a soul? We are still trying to find it. And let's go over our homework. Let me just do a quick poll. Did you watch episode one? Did you watch episode one of me playing Beyond Two Souls last Wednesday? Just wanna take a quick pulse check. See where you're at. See where we're at. Sorry to disturb me. It's homework time. Why is the poll white for you? I think there's some there's some update they did. Um, I I don't know why, but it's not me because it's blue for me. 
It's Susan's fault. Tell her to come back. I think it's a display issue. Like the text is white on a white surface. That's my uneducated guess, but it's a formatting thing. Is it on all mobile apps that it's just white? Like that's pretty bad. We should tell Susan about that. <laughs> the top is yes, bottom is no, for those of you who can't see the poll. Maybe that's why all my poll results are unreliable because the technology doesn't even work. Oh my God. Hi, Simply. Hi, Jody. I watched it on VOD and I, when I heard her name was Jody, I was like, oh my God, that's me. <laughs> it is you. It's Jody and Aiden. All right, so this homework was submitted by four, just the number four on Discord, not Connie, but I do believe Connie said finally someone else did their homework. <laughs> Somewhere, I forget where it is. <laughs> Unless I missed it, I apologize if there was another homework submission that I just failed to see. Oh no, it was Avalu. Wait, so hold on a second. There's two of them. Oh my God, multiple of you did your homework. <laughs> I was not expecting many homework submissions. Okay, shout out to everyone who did their homework. We've got Avalu. And then Connie had said, yes, I'm happy to see another diligent student. I finally get to copy someone else's homework. And then four also submitted their own work. Damn, this is, a, this is the first time I've seen multiple people <laughs> submit their homework. Extra credit for all of you. Amazing. Menchie Gang is in their academic era. Exactly, they're all getting the full, full ride scholarship. <laughs> Thank you, SC, for the Menchie Gang gifted. Thank you, Madeline. Haven't been here for stream in a hot minute, but today is my birthday. Happy birthday. Woo. Extra credit. Okay, I'm gonna end the poll. Now, these results probably <laughs> are unreliable because half of you can't see the poll. But 72% uh, said they watched last week. All right, so let's go ahead and read this. I mean, look, these are both so good. Wait, which one is shorter? We'll read the shorter one. Four pages, oh my God. Four pages and five pages. <laughs> These are so good. Oh my God. Okay, okay. I appreciate both of you. Amazing, incredible work. A freaking plus. All right. So Beyond Two Souls, game by the same people as Detroit Become Human, but it's not the same game, clearly. <laughs> Last week was kind of like a lot, so let, let's go through it. And Heavy Rain, Jason, same people. Side note, this recap is broken into the chapters highlighting known facts based on the choices simply made. Yes, no unplayed chapter spoilers are included in this summary. Thank you. <laughs> Prologue, we are introduced to protagonist Jody with a narrative-based gameplay, we learn her story. And then the experiment. As a, as a child, it appears Jody lives in a lab setting so scientists, um, with scientists so they can better study her psychic ability. Looks a lot like Eleven from Stranger Things type thing. We learn through the experiment that Jody is connected to an entity, Aiden, or Aiden as they like to pronounce it, who we can control to travel to other rooms, move objects, and even possess others. In the next scene, we meet Jody's parents, in quotations, Susan and Philip. We also learn that Aiden can be used for evil, like strangling children and stealing cookies. <laughs> and then it's like undetected. Oops. Causing Jody to resent us sometimes. Is he also one of the monsters that torments Jody? So is he like tormenting ourselves, basically? Our uh, twin soul. Uh, Nathan Dawkins, a scientist working for the Department of Paranormal Activity. He interviews Jody to learn more about Aiden. Um, shrug does not equal no, and we trust no adults. <laughs> oh, yeah. Whenever we were asked a question, we just went. 
<laughs> like any any child who wants to evade answering. Trust no adults ever. Even when you're an adult, trust no adult. <laughs> the first night. Okay, our parents left us <laughs> temporarily. And we didn't get a chance to spy at Dawkins and the parents' conversation. We needed to use Aiden right when they are walking as a future gameplay hint if we need to spy more in the future. Oh, is that a hint for me? <laughs> Thank you. We also met Cole and lost to the entities who Aiden is supposed to protect us from. Did I lose? Did I lose? I was pressing the buttons, okay? When they asked me to press the buttons, I pressed the buttons. Chapter six, alone. Our parents have relocated, leaving us to the care of Professor Dawkins. The parents were like, this child is a nightmare, okay? Doctor, you keep her. <laughs> Simply just being a monster and strangling our father then blaming the controls. Okay, listen, this game, when it presents you with a choice, it's not a clear and concise choice like I have experienced in Detroit Become Human. It's just like, press this blue button and something will happen. <laughs> Now, maybe I could have reasonably assumed that it'd be a negative outcome for the father, but I didn't know if it meant like murder him or not. I think I learned when it it was used to hurt him that I, then I became resistant to using that control at all, which we'll see later. Unless it was like throwing a beer can at a wall. Chapter seven, the party. Teenage Jody goes to Kirsten's birthday party. The daughter of one of the DPA workers simply may have gotten drunk accidentally, but no kissing the boy, 2%. Was that a 2%? I don't even remember what proportion. <laughs> we did show off our powers after being peer pressured into doing it. After Kirsten got mad at Jody for her birthday gift, the teens terrorized her and locked Jody in the closet. With Aiden's help, we got, we got out, we got out a little bit of revenge. Just a little, okay? Like no murders, but just fucking around a little, you know? In our rebel teenage phase, Jody wanted a night out to go see her friends. When Dawkins said no, of course, Aiden had to possess Cole and help us successfully sneak out. And then we just randomly ended up at some shady bar with pool tables and creepy old men. Why our friends would say they'd want to meet us there in the first place still doesn't make any sense to me. Like what? <laughs> like, doesn't even seem like a location that we would meet up. Just a storyline I'm still confused by and just feels very contrived. Um, play, we played pool with some guys who ultimately just wanted to take advantage of Jody. Aiden does his invisible tormenting and although given the option to shoot the attackers, rationale simply says no. <laughs> because we could not at that point use the defense of self-defense. It would not apply given the circumstances. So I was thinking like a, like a lawyer. <laughs> Your honor, <laughs> I would not be able to argue self-defense given the outcomes. We'd already, you know, escaped. I then can't shoot him. <laughs> like that's not gonna work. Chat wanted murder and I said, no, you will actually go to jail. <laughs> You will, it will not work the way you think it will. I know this is a game, but whatever, it's fine. Chapter nine, the condenser. The DPA said, uh, the DPA to better study the infra world has created a condenser that opens into the beyond where Aiden and other entities live. Okay, this was actually unclear to me, so I really appreciate the summary. Okay, so that place we went was where other entities like hang out, okay. Once free, the entities wreaked havoc and then they killed everyone. <laughs> when Jody's tasked to shut down the condenser, we learned another one of Aiden's powder powers, the ability to let Jody look into past memories of those that passed. After battling some entities and dead scientists possessed by entities, we successfully managed to shut down the condenser, blowing everything up just like in Detroit Become Human where I laughed hysterically. We did not save North either. Teenage Jody and Dawkins in the middle of what seems to be another experiment. That's where we left off. Final clarifications. When successfully found and unlocked, align the dots in the middle. These dots spread out in places and unlock bonus options. Also, as a side note, we are playing this game in chronological remix order, which is technically not how it was originally developed, but I guess more logical for simply. 
I didn't choose a way, that's just the way the game started. I did see a few people saying like you could play it the other way, but I I didn't even, like when we started the game, was there an option? I don't ever remember saying like, would you, would you like to play chronologically or not? So I don't know. I mean, I suppose you could switch it later, but I, I didn't choose it. I was just like, just press the button, <laughs> just press start. I was wondering why it was in order. Oh, is the traditional way to play it out of order? Hmm. There was def an option I saw it, we did? Okay, I ignored it then, apparently. Thank you, Danielle, for the wonderful recap. I'll just skim through this if there was a different picture. Jody literally tells you when it's time to use Aiden. Listen to her voice. Listen to the child! You've got to have a suspension of disbelief with this type of game. Don't go crazy trying to rationalize. <laughs> have you met Simply Not Logical? Who is also ironically very logical. All right. Let's get started, I'm gonna pull it up. Oh, look at Menchi while I pull it up, cause she's a sweetie. Big thank you to everyone in the Discord who uh, did their homework, A plus. Uh, as always, no spoilers, please. I know this game is like 10 years old, so some people have already played it. But... Should I give you a Menchie? I'll give you a Menchie. Ready? Yeah. Cole? Okay, I'm recording. Now concentrate, Jody. Tell me if you feel anything in particular about any of these objects. Oh, it wants me to do something. Um, what do I... Is that a no? No. That's a big ass coin. Is that a coin? What is that? Can you see anything, Aiden? Wee! I miss flying. forgot like what I'm supposed to do. Daughter? Is 
actual daughter. We're not his real daughter. Daddy. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Did you see something? I saw a little girl. It was her music box. Hello? Yeah. Nathan? Okay, I'll tell him. Do we have real siblings? Nathan, someone named Ryan Clayton is here to see you. He says you know what it's about. Who? Yes. I'll be back in a moment. Is that... Yeah. Is Laura his... his daughter? Or another lab rat? Oh, I'm free. Run! Run! <laughs> what, what do I do? Ah, run! Making my way downtown, walking fast. Gonna blow this fucking place up. Burn. Can I sit? Oh my god, I'm sitting down. Why am I sitting? What, do, what am I doing here? Hello? What are we doing? Oh, this is a nice monitor. Nice setup. It would be great to stream here. How do I talk to him? Oh, homework? Homework. <laughs> I hope we don't finish too late. <laughs> I have tons of homework to do. You know, Nathan's always complaining when recap. I get bad grades. He's always keeping me here when I should be studying. <laughs> That's a discussion you'll have to have with him, Princess. Don't call me Princess. Uh, visitor. Who's a visitor? Do you know this guy who's come to see Nathan? No idea. Liar. What can I do? Can I spy? As Aiden? What are you writing, sir? Oh my god, you have the keyboards that are meant for good wrist posture. <laughs> Long? Do you think he'll be long? Relax, princess. He'll be back in a minute. Ew, can you stop calling me princess? I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm so hungry. When do we get a break? Yeah, I'm hungry too. We need to get Nathan out of here for once. Somewhere fancy. Fancy? I'm sick of cafeteria food. Let's go to McDonald's. Is that fancy? Okay. So I can spy, right? My assistant and I are the only family she's got. Who's this? She doesn't have any idea what's out there. You on CSI Miami? Why do you look familiar? Look, I, Dawkins, I see your side of it. All right, I do. But orders are orders, right? From the court? Court order. You gonna bring her to me or do I have to go and get her? Who are you? Show me your warrant. Where's the court order? Anything else I can do in here? Oh, guess not. Jody, could you come here, please? No, I will not listen to you. I'm a teenager, dumbass. <laughs> okay, so if I'm Aiden, can I do anything? Whee! Usually there's like a thingy I can click, but there's nothing that I can see. Unless it's in here. Woo! Woo! What? Hello? You know, sometimes there's like a get out of jail. Oh, no, nope, I can't go that far. Can I go this way? We're just stalling. What's this? Can I press this button? 
what are these? Are these like hard drives? Look how many terabytes of storage. <laughs> Give me your terabytes. Okay. All right, I think I just have to go talk to them. Talk my way out of it. No, I would like to see the court order and, court order and read it for myself. Thank you. I can read. <laughs> what's what's going on, Nathan? You you look upset. Jody, this is Ryan Clayton from the CIA. The CIA. The agency. The agency wants you to join their military school program. How at much they're gonna pay me? <laughs> Ryan's gonna take care of you from now on. <laughs> I'm sorry. You have to go with him, Jeff. Is this a job offer? Today. Why? I don't understand. Why me? No, we know why. It's I meant why now. It belongs to the CIA. They've been tracking your case ever since you arrived. They know what you and Aiden can do. Excuse me. Be beg, angry, determined. I am not a child. I can make my own decisions. No one can force me to go. Hey, Jody, I know. Yeah, just, it's what, where's my letter of offer? You need to understand, this is a great opportunity for show, you. Show that to me then. Cynical, cold, aggressive, determined. No one can tell me what to do with my life. usually like the average Listen, rational listen, reason listen response. Response. I don't give a shit about your pathetic oh, never mind. adolescent pouting. <laughs> all right? You can rant and rave all you want, but you'll shut your mouth and do as you're <laughs> Let's go. Come here. Yeah, it's not gonna work. You can't hand back the same energy. You gotta manipulate it. Jody. Jody, stop immediately. Through Aiden. Manipulate him. Show him he's a dumbass. Do this for me. Why? What does it mean to you? Is he getting a raise if we go to the CIA? I'll go get my things. Why did we just oblige? Okay, the game wrote that, not me. Only the essentials. We've got everything you need at Camp Perry. that stand for Christine in America <laughs> are those like party dresses or, we didn't pack our party dresses my fake parents <laughs> Oops. I don't like these controls because I feel like there was an option to put it in my bag, but I didn't realize that until after. I would have put that picture in my bag. I'm not that cold. What should I do with the bunny rabbit? Is it going to give me an option? See? Okay, it's put it in the bag or leave it. I don't need a bunny rabbit. That's stupid. But I would have taken the picture. <laughs> Okay, what else? What else? Can I take any snacks? What are those pizza box? We 
we need the bunny rabbit? No, we don't. <laughs> Are you seven? <laughs> okay, look, another pig. Well, that's our fake parents. Well, fuck them. I'd rather these, these more recent fake parents. See, there's, the only option is to go into your bag. There's only one option. Why? Oh, no. The option is to rip it. You see how unclear? Instructions unclear. game is like a, a little old, you know what I mean? It's not fully a... Okay, what else can I do? Uh, can I be Aiden? What is this? Can I take my fan? Oh. I didn't mean to do that. That's stupid. What's this? Just to open it? Okay, I don't want to destroy the place. I'm not a teenage boy. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna break. It's such like teenage boy reactionary behavior, you know what I mean? Like, I'm mad, I'm just gonna punch this wall. Okay, that doesn't get me anywhere. But is there something more intelligent I can do with my power? Ooh, what is this classified document? Any secret hollow taco stuff on it? Hmm. I that white dot is just for us. Okay. Okay. That's for real us, not Iden. Okay, no Iden stuff. Alright, sorry, I did not mean to break <laughs> shit. I don't know. It was just the buttons made available to me. <laughs> Leave or stay? Wait, what? I can stay? I thought I didn't have an option. What happens if I stay? I do something. You cry forever? That's boring. I want the picture, but I think it. I can't pick it up now. I want the picture of my new fake parents. Let's see how it's like down. I can't take it. Maybe I'll go pee before I go. Okay, that's why. Guys, I have to pee. Let me pee. Please. <laughs> Please respect my privacy and let me pee in peace. You're going to need that bunny? Why would I need a bunny? What did I just take? Who was that? What is this? Britney Spears Curious Perfume? <laughs> You take the bunny for a happy ending? What kind of game depends on whether or not you take pink bunny rabbit? Like, that is so stupid. <laughs> no. Wait, can I, like, lie down? I'm just gonna sit here and cry. I'm just gonna reflect for a minute about the nail art that didn't turn out good. It's me when I I do a nail art that doesn't work. I just cry in my room. Ah, I just hit my head. Okay, should we leave? I'm not taking the bunny. And then when I lose this game and it's because of the bunny, then I, I'll just never shut up about how dumb that was. <laughs> Should I stay or should I go now? Now, now, now. If I stay, I will be trouble. Should I stay or should I go? Don't worry, I got my nail oil in my bag. Don't worry. I'm sure.
sure you'll be great. Is this a job? Damn. I'm gonna miss the hell out of you, princess. <laughs> Bye, boys! <laughs> I'll come and see you as soon as I can. Okay, fake dad. I'll never let you down. You know that, don't you? I just want to know where's my letter of offer. What's my salary? I'll always be there for you. What are my job requirements? Time to go. Who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> is that my boss? Please make the expectations clear, sir. That's why we're upset, because they just said, we're taking you, and didn't give me any explanation, nothing. So obviously we're gonna be mad, okay? Like, it's their fault, bad strategy. Terrible strategy. Terrible. <sighs> Separation. 81% told Dawkins what you saw. 83% threatened Clayton. 62% spied on Clayton and Dawkins. Wow. We are in the majority three for three. This is rare. <laughs> Wild. Okay. Next chapter. Central Intelligence Agency. CIA is like CSIS in Canada. I always forget what the equivalent is. Does anyone work for the CIA? Can you tell me, even if you could? It's your room. This is where you'll study and sleep for the next three years. The fuck, three years, training bro. Training tomorrow at 5 a.m. What training? Again, what is my position? What is my salary? Thank you. What is this prison? This looks like prison. Actually, this looks like my this looks like my dorm. <laughs> what the fuck is this? You just throw me in the military? <laughs> no. I hate it here. This is very like American dystopia though, isn't it? Except probably not common to oh. Come on, Holmes, keep Sorry, up! Sorry, I can't oh. run. <laughs> okay, okay. Ah! 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 I'm a horse. Think about it. I'm a horse. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go. I'm. Ah! Ah! What? Too late. Move the right stick when the action is in slow motion. Continue A. Move the right stick. Military fucking obstacle games. Okay, how about F's for me? Just send me right back to that cozy place with my fake parents, the doctors. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's try it as a game. Monkey bars. Find your grip. I'm a monkey. Use your momentum to swing across. I'm a monkey. Hurry. I'm a monkey. Rah! I'm a monkey, not a donkey. We got this. That's it, Holmes. Come on. I haven't got all day. What else are you doing? This is your job. I never understood that. I haven't got all day, and it's like, no, but you do. This is your job. You're sweaty. Got it. Why is this? This is very slow. <laughs> She's not bad for a kidnapped young lady. <laughs> not bad, given that we kidnapped her from her pair, her fake parents. Oh, wrong. Let's 
start again. Why are we doing this? Like, we don't need to do this. We have special powers, you know what I mean? Like, we should be exempt. <laughs> oh no! Let's start again. No, I don't want to start again. I want lunch. It's tea time. Not that intuitive, I'm telling you. Okay, sometimes there's no arrow and sometimes there's an arrow. That's why it's confusing. Let's start again. Like, you gotta just tell me. Am I following an arrow or am I guessing? Like here I'm guessing it's to the left, here I'm guessing it's to the left, there I'm guessing it's to the left, there I'm guessing it's to the right. Guessing it's down. But sometimes there's an arrow. Okay, there was no arrow that time. Minty, are you licking your bed? Aim, shoot. Oh no. Advance the next couple. Got it? They kidnap me and turn me into a murderer. Great. Cover. Come on! Get out of there! Lean? Uh oh, this is gonna be hard. Behind cover, you dick. Lean. Go, go, go! Stop yelling. Come on! I'm a recruit. When I first started at uh, Statistics Canada, they they called us recruits. <laughs> Just like this. Good. My instructions didn't look like that though. But what am I doing now? Taking notes? N to the K is down. One over K is left. Is, what is that, Einstein? <laughs> Energy? <laughs> UDN, oh my God! This is so, this is the hardest math I've seen in my life. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, recruit. What? Now get rid of those oil drums. Oh, now we can use Iden. Oh, we should have done this smarter. It's Jenga, bitches. Good. Let's keep going. direction. I don't know. Girl, you don't, you don't need to pull a gun on him right there. The fuck was that? that was she smiled. You crazy. That was a little psycho there. Recruit! 
It's not a fucking Sunday stroll. I don't know what day is it. You tell me. It's Wednesday. <sighs> Just a Wednesday stroll, yeah? Oh. I... oh my god, my legs hurt watching this. <laughs> You're doing the splits now? Why? <laughs> Why? Why do we? <laughs> What happened? We're healing our wounds now? Maintain the two orbs on the wound. Oh my god, I wish this was possible. I wish I could do that. <laughs> Tide crunch. Tide crunch. We're tired. We look tired. Come on. <laughs> Do I ever get to sleep? <laughs> Did you just hit his buddy? <laughs> get off of me! Stupid bully! <laughs> you kidnapped me. I think we probably like have learned to like them though, right? It's probably one of those situations like Stockholm Syndrome. Mm. Not bad. You probably think he's our dad now. Okay, I would like to know what I am training for. What you kidnapped me to use me for. Thank you. Playing golf? Capture the flag? Okay, what now? Use Iden to distract? Oh. something up over here. Ah. What am I supposed to distract you with? Am I dumb? Right in front of you, this? The guy himself? It doesn't, it doesn't do anything. I can't click the guy. Oh, the barrel over there.
Is he okay? Like, this is just a game, right? Did in the wrong order. Do to spend the whole fucking night here. Let's do it no. again. <laughs> no, I don't wanna. Oh my god. I just did it in the wrong order. But I didn't know there was a guy standing there. Yeah. I'm just a little recruit. I'm just a baby. Why is she going backwards? We're supposed to go this way. Oh my god. Jody! <laughs> you wanna get shot? Come on, start again! <laughs> So many sequences I just like couldn't get. <laughs> just like that, it's the same. It's exactly the same. What? Jody! You wanna get shot? Come on, start again! I swear, like, why is it different? I didn't do anything special here last time. I just pressed A. And then I guess you wait for him to go. And then you press A. Probably gonna die again. Like he's right there. Does he just not see me? Watch. Fuck. Jody! You wanna get shot? Come on, start again! <laughs> okay, why was it why had I had zero issues the first time? Like no one came for me the whole time. What? Actually, you know what? I went this way last time. Why don't I just go this way? Pressing X. Fuck. 
Oh, maybe I didn't go this way. I guess it's the same way, it doesn't really matter. Okay, this is pretty frustrating because I don't know why, but the first time I did this, there was zero issues, and now it feels like I'm never gonna win. That's fun. Like, I just can't go to the next section, right? Before I... Use Iden? Like, he's just over there, right? Sad. It's so confusing. <laughs> hey, sweetie. Ooh, who wants a menchi? Pierogies and menchi. That's what smells. Just the pierogies. The pierogies are smelly. Well, now what? What if I can never get through this? What do I do? <laughs> I have no soul, that's the answer. <laughs> it's just a fork, just an empty fork. <laughs> Beat this for me. <laughs> What's wrong? What do you have to do? What do you do? It'll show you. It's, yeah, you don't have much freedom to move. Just press A. But, like, watch. You have to distract the guy, so you have to press this button. And then fly to that can. How do I distract? You'll see. Fly to the can. And then whenever you see the blue dot, you have to back up to see the blue dot. Then you this and pull these. Both, both of them at the same time, yeah. And then it, whatever, it does that. Oh it's just stupid. Okay, well, that looks good. It just distracts him, and then you press Y to go back to her, and then it'll let you press X shortly to take him down. Yeah. So you 
basically have to repeat this. Hit that like, block. But you're just me what to do, I guess. Because every time I try and do it, they always catch me and I don't understand. Because like there's guys over there that you can't see, but you can see by pressing Y if you become your to like he's right there. How did he not see you? What? Where next? Where's my powers? Press Y to have your powers, and then you can fly. And you can. can I do it? He's probably gonna see. No. I just saw you. I Jody, you wanna get shot? Come on, start again. Well, this is like a training. Yeah. I've got sour cream downstairs. Silas. Okay, go get the sour cream. Are you just not enjoying this? No, I like literally can't do it. I don't understand. I did it perfectly the first time by chance, and then I ran into like one guy that I just did back. Watch with. someone else. Play. If you can't figure out the video game, watch someone else. Play. But I don't know what they're pressing. <laughs> You'll see. What they're doing. Yeah, but it won't show me like what buttons they're pressing. Okay, Ben, get the sour cream so no Zyler. <laughs> Okay, who wants a pierogi? Thanks for coming to class for a pierogi. Um, let me just take Minchie off. Oops, that's me. Nom nom. See, even Ben said it's hard. <laughs> There's written out steps, but will I be able to follow them? Potatoes in a sack. Okay, I'm Iden. And I know there's a thingy here, so I can just do this. And that'll get me to just here. Can I go this way? Now I'm Iden again. to take down.
Okay, wait, wait, wait. This is where I have to do the guy first, right? Guy at the top first. Let me do it again, I swear to God. How can I distract him? There's no item stuff. Oh, but I need to distract him again to ensure he'll look the other direction. You have to be quicker. Ugh. Now what do I do? Run? I just press X and nothing happened. Not bad, Jody. But if this wasn't an exercise, you'd be dead by now. This is the dumbest game ever. I hate this. If this wasn't an exercise, you wouldn't even be able to open your big mouth, Ryan. <laughs> Congratulations, Operative Holmes. You made it. Welcome to the agency. Great. I don't want to be here. Thank you, sir. No, don't thank him. Yeah, Jody. Welcome to the agency. It looks like you Great made job, it. Jody. Congratulations. I hate this place. I would like to go home now. <laughs> what do you mean, welcome to the agency? I was kidnapped, bruh. Yeah, where's your HR department? Okay. I'm gonna have a little quick pierogi. What is a pierogi? Does anyone know? Dr. Sherbear, thank you. How is Ben at the grocery store if he was just making pierogies? A pierogi is a Polish dumpling. A Polish dumpling. Polish mountain. It's a potato ravioli. It's Polish. It's nail polish. Are we eating nail polish? I was helping my child with homework. Why is Jody in the CIA now? I don't know. It's a good question. We were never asked. 
to go to the CIA. Last I recall, we were doing homework. <laughs> Was there a, a path to getting kicked out of the CIA? No, because I failed their training like multiple times and still didn't get kicked out. <laughs> This game takes place in America. They want to weaponize her. I mean, that's most video games. And Canada's always painted as the safe haven. I'm surprised we haven't run into like, oh, if you go to Canada, then they won't kidnap you there. <laughs> if only I could escape to Canada and I could live in peace with my powers. <laughs> Where is that path? <laughs> All right, 22% in need of physical training. What? 43%. <laughs> Spotted during training. Okay, well, you know, we didn't suck that hard. We sucked with like just under half. 79% tremendous fighter. Oh, that's spot, spot the contradiction. The fuck is this? Ew, don't, don't touch him. Who are these people? Oh, diplomats, politicians, businessmen, spies. It's the usual embassy crowd. Why? What do I do if something goes wrong? There won't be anything you can do. That's what I suspected. Just I check like my Swarovski jewelry, though. But most important thing, act natural. Oh, yeah, this is so Anyone natural. speaks to you, you just smile. So do you want me to act natural, or do you want me to smile? <laughs> I didn't know you had a sense of humor. I just kidnapped you. Only when I'm scared to death. Ryan, I'm delighted you could attend. Always a pleasure, Sheikh Ahmed. I uh, would like you to meet my assistant, Elizabeth. I was unaware that American diplomacy was undertaken with such disarming charm. The pleasure is mine, Elizabeth. What? Gentlemen. Sir, what? I give you back your host. We'll talk later on that. Until then, Ryan. Wait, what? So, he's CIA trying to spy on like foreign affairs? He hates me. Foreign affairs? Well, time he was imagining my head on a stick. He found you charming. I should be flattered. Remember his secret weapon. Yeah, I'm gonna shake some hands, blend in, find some more quiet. You know what you have I to do. wouldn't say blend in out loud, you dumbass. Uh, ambassador, you're a sight I'm gonna blend eyes. in. Hey, Ambassador! I need she to find like a quiet me. place. Follow her. Hello, are you me? Why do we all look the same? Hello? Hello? Hey, lady, did they kidnap you too? Why can't I talk to her? Can I have a drink? Girl, let's get wasted! <laughs>
hands wash. <laughs> they locked me out. <laughs> okay. I don't know you need a key. Don't look at me. The toilet is gold. The toilet is gold. And I'm sitting on it. Oops. Ew, the floor is nasty. Don't. Ugh. <laughs> it's a public restroom. Hayden. Hayden, are you ready? What are we doing? There's a large painting in one of the rooms upstairs. Behind it is a safe. The documents we're looking for are inside. But there are guards and cameras, so you have to be careful. You got it? Understood. Still don't know what we're doing. But we're looking for documents. Yeah, well, why are we saying this out loud? Okay. So, do I just go? Is this you telling me to go? Are you gonna pee? You look like you need to pee, girl. Going upstairs? Do I leave you? What's happening? Where do those other bitches go? <laughs> Can I spam on other people? Oh, no one else is peeing! Hurry, I did. Hurry, I want to spy. It hurts like hell when you're too far away. It hurts like hell. You'll be fine. Hold on. I want to see something. <laughs> Wait, is that CIA? Oh no. This is no time to mess around. It. For an office. Okay, fine. At the first floor with a portrait of the okay, sheik. Relax. And watch out for the guards and the video surveillance. Careful, Aiden. You know you can't touch other people when you're controlling someone. You can't touch other people when you're controlling someone? An office with a portrait of the Sheik. Is, it, is this it? This is the place. Oh The cameras. I told you to take care of them first. Oops. What do I do? Man, Anna, Anna, Bunto, Ara, Kula, Shayin, Ara, Mayoran. And the Darif Zayid and Nahula, you see. How do I take care of the cameras first, I then? This is the place. I didn't. You know what to do. What? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Crap. You gotta distract the guard first. I'm 
عن العمل في منتصف المباراه Switch somewhere. To move the painting. A switch to move the painting. Find it, I okay. did. Hey, just relax. Stop crying. <laughs> Holy shit. There's gotta be a switch somewhere. <laughs> oh my god, open all the drawers. Open all the drawers, I love it. When I come to your house, I'm gonna open the drawers. Okay, now what? I, I don't know even know what I'm doing. Why is the light so bright? It's not it's right there. D was that a switch? Did I hit a switch? What's happening? Where are you? In some diplomat, really rich diplomat's office, I think. We're running okay. out of time. <laughs> I can't bear the pain. You can't anymore. relent. <laughs> She's always crying. <laughs> okay. I think I think that this winch. Uh, oh my god, I need this winch. Uh. Get, get, get the painting, I need uh. In your hand, I Now let's see if you can open the safe. Good job. Now we have to read the documents. Make it quick. I can't hold on much longer. I can't read. I'm a woman. I'm not allowed. Okay. Now don't move. If I press it wrong. Fuck. Girl. Oh, she peeing? She's peeing! <laughs> yes! Woo! Press that button to pee! Oh! This is the longest pee of my life. I love it. Oh, it felt so good. <laughs> هل من أحد هناك؟ سير. الرجاء الخروج من هناك على الفور. ولكن ماذا تفعل هنا؟ إن هم رهدة سيدات. انصرف من هنا. أيها المنحرف. سأنصرف. I need captions. You can't just walk in here. Excuse me. Sorry, I can't do anything to help you. What? I didn't, what I didn't ask for your help. Why are you stealing my papers? What the fuck just happened? I literally have no idea what's happening. That was very unclear. Anyone else as confused as I am? Maybe if I wash my face, I'll go back to my first set of parents. Girl. Don't mind me, I'm just drunk, stumbling in the men's restroom. Just kidding. Am I okay? 
Jody, all right? Don't touch me! I want to go now. Right. Yeah, we're leaving. Hello? What has happened? All I wanted was the pierogi appetizer. 98% finish the mission. Oh my god, RIP to the 2%. So I finished the mission? Did I win? Mm. We're at the embassy. <laughs> the embassy, I see. Why well, just simply want to go to the man's bathroom? I just want to go everywhere, you know? I just need to do a proper perimeter sweep. <laughs> Where are we now? Were we kidnapped? Do we have new parents? Is this New York? It looks like a modern condo. With a nice pleather couch. Yeah. Jody. Hey, it's, it's Ryan. Ryan. I was just wondering if you got no. my email. I, j I blocked you, actually. What, wait, what, what email? The one I, I sent three days ago. You know, I've, I've actually been having problems with my computer. What, what was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. <laughs> Are we still kidnapped? Anyway, it's, it's too late now, so... Maybe another time? Shit. Shit, I'm so sorry. I... You know, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I don't think... I mean, you wanted to see my apartment I don't apartment think we're ready anyway, for dinner. So. Uh, <laughs> sure, but I... How about around eight? Just... Looks pretty late already. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. Do we later. like Ryan? No, he kidnapped us. But we probably have Stockholm Syndrome because we were kidnapped as like a 16 year old. And we have no parents, which Ryan knows. So definitely preying on our vulnerabilities. Now I get why you blasted my computer. Yeah, because Aiden is smarter than you. You didn't want me to see Ryan. Correct. It's not your call, yes, Aiden. Is. I can do what I want. You are still a child, basically, because you never grew up properly. Fuck this. We have a nice fucking Fuck this! Though. We're not gonna start this again! I'm not yours, Aiden! I can have a relationship with whoever I want. <laughs> this game is so fucked is up. My life. Like, what? Okay, do you fucking hear me? This is my Girl, no. Life. I am your father. Well, then, I happen to think Ryan is great. He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. He's the only recent father and figure I that has been imposed on us. We were kidnapped and then forced to trust him. Yeah, I'm aware of what Look, happened. There's tea! Tea. Fuck you for reminding me. For reminding Ryan you, girl. Like that. Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself That's look not going to happen. The tidying up and cleaning, not the make yourself look good part. You think, what is this beautiful home? Did they finally give us our money <laughs> that we deserved? Did we finally secure that contract? Like, I think so, right? Like, it looks like it. Why are we wearing the smallest underwear? I would like to put on my pajamas, please. The trash can in the kitchen. Is there an option to put on clothes? This is exactly what they did in um, uh, Detroit Become Human and Heavy Rain. There was like a half naked lady, right? Like walking around in underwear. And that was like just the storyline. The storyline is half naked lady. The year was 2013, and women were in video games. 
That's not even that long ago. Okay, do I have to clean? Yes, I do, because I am a woman character. <laughs> Just kidding. It's like unpacking now. I do wonder though, because aren't these Books. games more okay, on the often bookshelf. to be played by young women? Oh my though? God! So when you say like, God, the dinner male gaze. Okay, there's there's got to be something in the kitchen. Is this trying to target a young male audience or a young woman audience? Like I I, I don't know, because I wasn't around really. It wasn't advertised to me. I'm a 35 year old lady. You know what I mean? But. <laughs> Who was this advertised for when it came out? Yeah, <laughs> the books in the go on the bookshelf. <laughs> no, they go in the kitchen. Okay, great. Lounge, jazz, romantic. Lounge. Oh my god, I just had flashbacks to when we fucked up the teenager's house. Okay, where are our clothes? Clothes? Put on clothes. Are these clothes? What is this? My room? This is so nice! <laughs> what? Wow! <laughs> You won't let me pee, but you will definitely work showering into the storyline. Also, I'm wearing a ponytail, okay? I don't know if you know this, men who make video games, um, but usually ladies with ponytails, or anyone with ponytails actually, <laughs> will remove the elastic to wash the hair. What? <laughs> I also rub my legs exactly like that with no soap. Mmm, I love rubbing my prickly legs. I also rest on the side just like that. <laughs> what is that? Because we didn't wash our hair! <laughs> my towels are also that small. Oh my god, it like only covers her hair. No one showers like this. My windows are wide open. Bruh, where are the blinds? Oh my god. The entire city's watching us. This is ridiculous. <laughs> really? Really? Was this necessary in the game? Okay, also, what is this? Is that an electric towel warmer? Why didn't, why wasn't it on there? Okay, I would like a warm towel. Well, what does my mirror say? You have me? You don't need him, you have me? Christ, Aiden. Like, you just don't get I it. I mean, we don't need him whether we have Aiden or not. Did he just ring the doorbell? Yeah, Crap. put on clothes. Crap, he's early. Where's my clothes? No. I'm coming. Where's clothes? What? Where's my closet? <laughs> Literally what? <laughs> What's my closet? That looks like a closet, right? It won't open. What? <laughs> it's good. Where's my closet? Is this a closet? Oh, thank God. What should I wear? Okay, well, we don't have much time to think about it. Cool, sexy, elegant. Cool, I'm, no, no, I meant to press, not elegant, ew. <laughs> I meant to press cool. Oh, hello, Ryan. Oh, do you like it? Classic, elegant, je ne sais quoi. Je sais pas, c'est terrible. Put back, put back, put back. Let him sit outside. I don't want to give him the wrong okay, idea. Where's my cool outfit? Oh. Cool. 
B. Oh, hey, Ryan. Yeah, whatever. I just like threw these old things on because, yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna be me. I mean, there's no point in me throwing myself at the guy. How old are we? We must be like 19 now. You might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. Period. <laughs> We're so messed up. <laughs> what time is it? 1939? My house is sick. Coming! I'm gonna marry my house instead. We don't need this guy. Hello? The fuck is this? I have two doors? Hello? Aiden. Oh, good one, Aiden. Okay, you got me. Now, open the door. Aiden! Aiden, come on, open up! Let's, let's, let's relax, everybody. Just everyone calm down, please. Let's have a little glass of amaretto on the rocks. Maybe an amaretto sour. Okay. Get a good book. What was that? I saw a button. Hey. What time is it? I can't read those clocks. Women don't know how to read clocks. Was I supposed to, to clean up his junk? I gotta find something I can make. They're gonna in make one me cook with what's ever left they in the fridge. Made me shower, clean, and cook. Oh, I hate being a woman. Asian beef. Oh, I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. Just order it. Curried chicken with oven baked <laughs> vegetables. It'll take some time. Why is this part of the storyline? <laughs> Seems doable. We're like a domesticated supernatural pizza young lady now. Pizza, pizza, pizza. I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no Love mess. It. I mean, it could be an option. Pizza. Pizza. I mean, it's it's the easy way out, but he's he not should gonna just mind. bring food. Actually, no, I'll call him. Like, we should tell him to bring food. <sighs> well, maybe he'll expect like a maybe real he'll dinner. He'll expect it. No, I don't. I want pizza. Nah, nah, pizza it is. We are so fucked up. Like, we are not okay. Okay, go to the phone. Call nine one one. Actually, that's what we should be doing. You know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not gonna Pizza. stop me from seeing Ryan. I didn't even call for pizza. Where's the front door? Well, this is my bedroom. Oops. I don't know my own house. I'm not gonna clean up. It's fine. Where's my front door? <laughs> what am I looking at? Oh, it made me clean up. <laughs> I didn't behave yourself. This is important to me and I'm counting on you. 
He's 33. And how old are we? <laughs> uh, Chateau Margot, 2001. I wasn't even born then, bitch. Yeah, in the stores, that was a pretty good year. That sounds good to me. So. <laughs> yeah, we're not getting pizza, just probes. It's hardly no, we're a not. mess. I mean, I just moved in, so it's... No, no problem. You did? Looks lived in. Why don't you sit? Um, I'll get the um, the thing that opens the wine. <laughs> cool apartment. Huh? Yeah, thanks. It is cool. I didn't. For fuck's sakes. That's like me, I go into your house, I open every cupboard. Wine opener. That can definitely do a murder if we're not careful. Okay, chat, don't get, don't get horny for murder now. Where even is he? Where do you go? Sure, would you like some, a glass of poison? Do you want me to open it? No, oh, no, I'll do it. Uh-oh, I don't know how to open mine. That's not a twist off. We don't even know, like, this is so weird. How it's do we know apartment. he even likes us? Like, why is it, why do we assume it's like that? It's my new apartment. <laughs> wow, so when did you move in? Um, a couple weeks ago, yeah, the agency found it for me and all it's furnished and everything. Which is, it's actually the first place I've ever had just by myself. So it's weird getting used to the idea. Of it. <laughs> this is a great conversation you guys are having. And did you did you grow up here? This is like no, no, I, I was born in Oregon. Like on the bad My parents and so brothers still live there. But I, I moved out when I was 16. 16? Oh. Did you, you could get kicked out or something? Wasn't I 16? I was 17. Uh, well, things were pretty chaotic at home. That's not that weird. My, my stepfather well, okay, liked to beat me when he had too I much to drink. Age. And uh, I just decided to get out before one of us went too far. Are we supposed to feel sorry for him now? Um, how did you end up joining the I don't want to know what he says, though. I, uh, I went through college, not really knowing what I wanted to do. Uh, tried the army. You know, looking for the action, travel, adventure. <laughs> long enough to realize that wasn't for me. <laughs> and when a CIA agent was here, for You didn't call for pizza. Don't touch him. <laughs> it, it's nothing. It's just Aiden's messing with us. Ignore him. I just, Ignore him. Okay, I want to hear what he says. You know, Ryan, I um, I actually didn't get around to making dinner, but I, I could, you know, go look in the fridge, like if you're hungry or you want. To. No, no, it's okay. Don't worry about it. Good. I didn't. Right, uh, well, I better get going. So why did he come? What? You're going already? Yeah, you know, it was good to see where you live. I'm, I'm glad you're all settled in. Hey, I'll, I'll see you tomorrow, all right? So we're still working together, right? Yeah. Yeah, tomorrow. Fuck. Should've made chicken curry. That would change everything. <laughs> Yeah, I know, it's my fault. I'm such a fucking idiot. No, you're just a baby. She's always crying. 
Maybe you're right. Maybe he's just not my type. I think we have much bigger things to cry about. I don't know about you, but... I wonder if anyone is. I've always got you, Aiden, right? Nothing bad happened. Oh, thank God. I thought that situation was going to be terrible. <laughs> okay, the dinner. 24% ordered a pizza or didn't cook. <laughs> um, 27% dressed casually. 21% left a messy apartment. 60% locked in the corridor by Aiden. And then we didn't get undiscovered paths. So I'm assuming there was more paths if you went along with what the game was trying to make you do. Jamal Sheikh Sharif, one of the most dangerous warlords in the country. He commands a heavily armed militia, using it to control several important districts in the city, which means none of our humanitarian aid is getting through. You have to find Jamal and eliminate him. Now, he relocates twice a day. Last time we pinpointed him was at the Zanaki Hotel, which is right here. Not much of a chance he's still there, but it's as good a place as any to start looking. You'll be on your own this mission. No direct engagement with the enemy, no backup. You identify and eliminate your target, then activate your GPS beacon so we can extract you. We need to get you out before sunrise, so don't waste any time. The last American soldier that was captured here was pulled through the city behind a jeep. They found his head, one of his legs, in a fishing boat. I wouldn't recommend it. I'll be back before they even realize what's happening. Watch yourself out there, Jody. I don't want anything to happen to you. Ah! <laughs> Move away! Why? <laughs> like, these games are just Don't wild. <laughs> I won't be alone. Like, where did this come from? He literally kidnapped us when we were 16. You are toxic if you want to make out with this man all of a sudden. Or you're just an impressionable child, which is not toxic, but your Good situation. Luck, Jody. Is... Good lord. Good lord. Again, another game, another trauma bond, asking you to make out with someone you either just met or who kidnapped you, one or the other. No direct engagement with the enemy, no backup. Check that there are no soldiers around, Aiden. Uh oh, I'm gonna lose. Can I possess? It's like stopping me. I can't go that far. I 
I'm supposed to go this way? Oh, how come I can't go through? That's bullshit! Ah. Stuck in a room? Oh my god, I'm trapped. Last time we pinpointed him was at the Zanaki Hotel, which is right here. See if you find anything. How about this blue dot right over here? Great. That's the well, let's go. Hotel. Can I just fly there and leave? No, I can't. This is blue dot. A new bonus has been unlocked. Oh my god, why are there people hanging? She 
Excuse me, where's the front door to the hotel? Susie, your front door is buried? This is an Aki hotel. Am I safe to approach? me into him. It won't let me possess him. I think I have to get closer. They've gone. They've gone home? Or the video game? near a ruined cathedral. There's one not far from here. Should be easy to find. woke up today and we're like, violence! Actually, it was the, the guy who trained us. What's his face? Our kidnapper. We blame him. Actually, we blame everyone in our life.
more distracting than Bob's. Ryan. Wait, that's the wrong way. This way. I think. What is my purpose? in a murder mood. You know sometimes you just get in a murder mood. They will not let me possess. Get out. I'm stuck. No. Oh, do I have to go up this? Go up. Hello? Uh oh. I think I'm in a weird dead end. Is that supposed to go this way? going that's the question I ask myself every day I am no superman I am no the cathedral. cathedral that's where I'm supposed to go from where did I see it in my vision They came here. Okay. It just it brought me here. <laughs> like what? What? Hold on, I need a sip of tea. Is this stream free to watch? No. You just spent a hundred dollars. Pay-per-view. Okay. 
okay? Don't for don't you forget. I will take your memories. For a hundred dollars, just like this. Hundred dollars for memory. Simply, let's go. not want her powers just saying you know i don't think i'd want to like touch things and hear their stories then i would never want to do anything ever again or talk to anyone <laughs> once i've heard all everything i'm like well you know i know too much now it would be very helpful though if you're doing jury duty did the job for me. Still working for the CIA. Is this a trap? And the CIA sent us because it's a solo mission. They were like, nobody else can go, just you. That's why Ryan was so sad because he like knows they're sending me to die or some shit. Just preparing myself. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. No, I'm not. I am going the wrong way. The game just told me go the other way. Why would they send me and only me? Presumably because they want to risk only me and no one else. They're like, you don't need help. You have Aiden. Aiden forgot to order pizza. Don't, don't ah. shoot me, okay? 
Jesus, fuck. The kid needs help. I gotta do something. How do I do? Am I a doctor? He's lost Can a lot I of blood. Do doctor magic? He's gonna die if I don't help him. Sorry, I, I, I don't understand a word you're saying. Salim, Salim. Your name is Salim. Salim. Jody. 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 Yeah. Yeah, Jody. 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 Oh shit. Looks like we have some new friends. Jody. 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 Get out of here before more show up. And why would this kid listen to us? I didn't wait so long, Del, but... It's okay. It's okay. We can heal ourselves, right? I'm all right. We make a damn good team, don't we, Salim? No. Don't bring a child into this. What the fuck is this game? <laughs> we make a good team, you seven-year-old. The sun is rising. Uh, I mean, I guess we were made into, like, now. a child warrior. So, this is what happens. Tower. It's 
cycle. Traumatic cycle. Towers over there. That's where I need to go. What have I got to lose? What? Hey, kid, come back. <laughs> Tell me what to do. Bigger than the child. Where'd he go? Uh oh, I lost him. He's too small. Straight through. Stay close, okay? Quick, help me! We should tell uh, Ryan that we have a new recruit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, not only did we defeat your stupid ass mission, but uh, we got a seven year old recruit. What do you think? Get rid of him. <laughs> vehicle, sir. Actually, we're just doing a safety emissions check. This vehicle is over 20 years old, sir, so we're just going to do a little carbon emissions check. without being noticed.
We escaped unscathed. They didn't see us. Are you okay, Salim? It's fucking crazy. Tayeb, Tayeb. Let me call him, dude. This is where we have to go our separate ways. I must go. Do you understand, Salim? Lana Trukuki. You can't go to the village of Nibuki. I'm sorry, but you can't come with me. Why not recruit him? <laughs> really brave, Salim. <laughs> come on. Someday, this is all gonna be over. And you can just go back to being. Yeah, a what kid. about us? <laughs> Does anyone know what he's saying? It's not translating it for me. Look, we're hugging him. That wasn't even a choice. It was built into the game, just so you know. Yeah, look, at the least we could do is recruit him. <laughs> Jamal Pull in was Angelina Jolie. Angelina Jolie. I don't have <laughs> much time. Chatter! Okay, what are we supposed to do? Blow some shit up again? Something is around here. That looks like a nice little target. Want to shoot me? Hello? I'm just running around and no one's shooting at me. Where's everyone? I just want to play. Huh? Hello?
get him? I'm feeling really brave. Oh god, oh god. Why isn't it showing me him? Oh my god, the controls are so bad! <laughs> it literally won't let me go this way. Okay, well, never mind. see me if I go right there though I have to go around this way there you go there's a glitch or something that's where I'm that's supposed it. to go okay now find a place close to the house where I can take cover You know what you have to do. Find your wall, I don't. I didn't have to go in. Okay, got it. Going in. Prison break. Hello? That's him. That guy. That's Jamal. I won't be able to get close enough. You're gonna have to do it. What is it? What is it? Don't no. Gotta keep a little okay. What do I do then, mother? Oh, what do you 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 do إنها كانت على علاقة ممتازة مع الرئيس السابق ولا يمكن أن تسمح لجمال أبدا أن يأخذ مكان أنا لا يمكنني رأي أمريكا في بلد كيف لا يمكنني أن أنسي هذا ما تنسى جمال الشمالية والجمالية هو هو ستاك كيف يمكن تجاهل ذلك هذا نعمل على توحيد الإجازة ونطلق Do it. Orders are orders. orders. Are orders. The guy's got blood on his hands. He See, deserves to die. This is a trap. Come on. Totally using I can do this. System. Like I feel I can like kill him. the CIA can kill him. fucked up and they're using us to like fix their mistakes. That's probably the plot. Right? Don't tell me. I'm guessing. <laughs> I'm 
someone open the door for me. I need to confirm that Jamal is dead. Hurry! Did he escape? Jamal escaped, and then we did all this for nothing. And then we got duped. Or no. He's there, and then we find out he's innocent or something. Take a picture, you'll get 50 bucks in Phasmophobia. It's like the kid's dad or something. <laughs> Don't worry, it's just catch up! Yeah. Abby, Abby, He's your father? Yeah, you dumb dumb. <laughs> like, oh my god. You must have fought to Zalek. What are we doing to ourselves? Oh, force field. At least and it's not crying. making us kill the child. Because that would be a game. <laughs> okay, let's go. What now? Gonna shoot me on the way out. Probably. Wait, what is this? Pat his back? Oh, well, that'll make it better. Yeah. Okay. Fuck. That was one big hint that Fuck, we who am I working for and why? Oh God! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Oh my God! Do I just die? I can't click anything. By the way. This must be a cutscene. Sit down. 
surely I didn't can do something. Ten years in the CIA. Never seen anything like it. Boss sends his own private helicopter to get an agent back. All the top brass are crazy about you, Jody. You and Aiden, of he course. sent the PJ? Jody. No. You okay? Listen. I know this one was tough. But it's over. I'm going home. Just another mission accomplished, right? I'll never forget what I saw back there, right? Never. This is a nice private jet, though. What uh, kind of sparkling water you guys have on board? Mm -hmm. That looks nice. What is it? Oh, that's a drug. Oh, I thought it was sparkling water. How's your leg? Better when this painkiller kicks in. What's that? Recliner? And the international community had just announced its official recognition of the election of the new president, Jamal Sheikh Sharif. Jamal Sheikh Sharif, one of the most dangerous warlords in the country. And now, sources report that he and all his government were assassinated in what appears to be an unclaimed attack. You have to find Jamal and eliminate him. Hopes were high that the newly recognized President Jamal Sharif would be able to put an end to the hostilities that have ravaged his country for many years. A number of world leaders have already expressed outrage at what appears to be nothing less than a cold-blooded execution. You have to find Jamal. He never said why. Well, well, well. I did it. What are you talking about? Jamal wasn't a warlord. He was the president. He was the democratically elected president. Your point? Look, we're not politicians. We had our orders. You knew I wouldn't have murdered him. So you lied to me. Welcome to the CIA, Jody. It's not fucking choir practice in case you haven't noticed. Now, we had a job to do, and we did it. End of story. This might just be a fucking job to you, okay? But I don't go around killing people because some poor fucking star general tells me to. What's going on? I didn't say. Land this plane. Jody, this 
Listen, you calm down. All right, we'll get back home and we'll talk about it, okay? You manipulated me. You used oh, yeah, me to do your do dirty work. What difference does baby. it make? Jody, you was a dead man walking with or without you. I have blood on my hands. Some kid lost his father because of me. Because I trusted you. Never trust because men. Because I trusted you. We were doing the right thing. The lesson is do not trust men. What am I, me, Ryan? A toy? Some fucking now, can you imagine how you much just do whatever you want with? We're then. getting massive turbulence. Fuck! I can't, I can't control it. Jody, for God's sake, you're gonna kill us. No one's ever gonna lie to me again, Ryan. Ah! Jody! Fuck! Jody! Girl, relax. We, we can make a point without jumping out of the airplane. Jody! <laughs> Good lord. Who are we gonna call? Which which fake father are we calling? The last one? Who, who do you think we're calling? Nathan Dawkins. Fake father? They used me to kill those people. Jody, what happened? I didn't know. I didn't know. I, I was just doing what I was told. Where are you? Is Clayton with you? No. No. No, I ran away. You can't run away from them. They'll hunt you down and they'll find you. You've got to come in, Jody. We'll talk. I'm sure... Oh, it's over, Nathan. Through being a toy. You tell them that if they try to find me, I'll kill them. Jody, listen... Tell I... them, Nathan. or obligation or otherwise. No choice. This is just a commentary on... Maybe I will reserve my thoughts on that one. The mission. 28% didn't kiss Ryan. Okay, 28% are fucking smart because as it turns out, Ryan betrayed us. Can you imagine how much more fucked up we'd be if we'd kissed him? <laughs> so good job, 28%. 87% avoided capture. I think that's good. 78% took the weapon from the soldier. 28% were rescued in the street. 57% were spotted in town, 81% spotted at checkpoint, 24% attempted, oops, I clicked the wrong button. <laughs> and then I was like, no, wait, don't click it, don't click it. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, uh, we're going to end it there. Let's just um, make sure the game saves. Checkpoint. We're on a train. Aiden! Aiden! Woo! What the F? Okay, um... I have some work to do to prepare for... Tomorrow and the next day. So, that's why we're gonna end it there at the three hour instead of the four hour mark. Yeah, lots of killing happened today. There was so much murder. So much that I think I'm gonna have like nightmares. There's a lot of murder. A lot of murder. <laughs> what kind of work? Oh, you know, just uh, CIA classified documents work. That was int that was very intense. That was a lot of me being like, ah! <laughs> so, so I apologize to uh, the headphone users. I did see a few people say the audio was off. I apologize. I don't know why or what that is. The game looked correct to me, both in my streamer and for me. So I don't know if that was YouTube. 
Um, yeah, was it ketchup or was it blood on my nail? You you won't know. Was it a blood sacrifice? I don't know. I guess you'll have to find out very soon, actually. You were being a pro? I don't know. I think the game was helping me. I don't think the game allows you to die. Oh, there you go. <laughs> you literally can't die. I came like this close to dying in many ways. Holy shit. The audio is the least of our problems. Don't worry. Yes, thank you for sure. Did you enjoy this chapter? This chapter was a little cleaner and better than the previous ones where I was like, what the fuck are these black blobs? Like I'm literally getting a migraine. So it was a little better because it, it looks slightly more like I kind of knew what to do, but I also half the time was like, where am I going? Like, <laughs> where's the, I'm, where am I pressing A? <laughs> you know what I mean? But it was fine. Your cam and voice was not delayed, but the game was very delayed. It was weird. That's, that is very weird. Uh, I don't know. Hmm. Nice sweater, Simply. It's very on brand for a certain green polish. What green polish? I don't see any green polishes. Did you, are you looking through my files? Are you looking through my classified documents to find green polishes? I, you gotta stop going through my shit, okay? This is the next mission, but I have not opened the file yet. Loyalty will open it first, actually. Mm -hmm. Hollow Swatchers and Hollow Royalty are going to be upgraded to the CIA. We're actually kidnapping them via email, and uh, they have no choice but to advance to the next mission, whether they like it or not. Yeah, that's how we're going to play it at Hollow Taco. <laughs> All right. Huge shout out to the mods, to the Mensch Gang members. I have not decided what I'm doing on Saturday, but I will be here and we will do nails and reviewing, looking at nails and stuff. But I haven't picked a theme of what to call the stream. But that's like the most irrelevant part. No one cares what I label my stream. But yeah, we will do something involving maybe new nail polish on Saturday but it's not a live launch stream. It's just my eyes that are itchy. That's it. It's not, I'm not being sussy. It's just my eyes. I used Aiden to look at your files. Ah! <laughs> Quick, press Y, use Aiden. What did the files tell you, huh? All right, everyone, get ready for 12 days of Christmas. That is a uh, Christmas with no H. I can't wait for how many emails we're gonna get asking why there's a typo in Christmas. I'm excited for that. <laughs> I think I should reply personally, just from Christine with no H. See if, see if it gets clued in, you know? All right, everyone, I will see you on Saturday and you will see more before even Saturday. So how's that? Okay. Thank, welcome cinnamon to the Mench Gang. Cinnamon, cinnamon, cinnamon. And um, <clears throat> all right, everyone. Just wanted to uh, check my files before I go. Yep, that's that's top secret. That is classified. That is uh, privileged and confidential. Uh, I, I see the date here. I see the contents classified. I see the matters of national redacted uh rejected oh interesting declassification date has been noted reason for declassification i see 12 days of christmas and uh, i see some redacted information on this so uh i'm just gonna put that back in my file but maybe there will be a detective who is capable of pressing the right buttons to you know crack the code declassify the contents and with that, thanks so much for watching. I'll see y'all later. Bye.